Dr. Amber here with the Physio Room, and I just wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about some core strengthening. Um, after having a baby, a lot of exercise programs include a lot of plank. They're a great functional activity. They create a lot of different muscle groups hitting, something you can very easily do with a baby or a kid and still be engaging with them. However, going from being pregnant to being able to do a full plank, isn't always feasible right away, especially if you've had any abdominal separation, anything like that. So I just wanna go through a little bit of a progression with you guys of how to get back to being able to plank safely and without pain. So the first step of it, I'm gonna have you guys come into a hands and knees type of position, kind of working in that cat camel position that they talk about with yoga and different things. Now in pregnancy, we end up with kind of an increased curvature in our low back through here. So a big part of what we're wanting to do when we're engaging our core, and especially our lower core, is to decrease that curve back to a normal level. So first we want to start on just using these lower abs, kind of think about pulling your belly button up towards your spine, pulling those hip bones in, um, kind of like you're tucking your tailbone underneath, but just coming up until you have a flat back. All the motion should be in your lower back, again, coming from that curve to flattening out. We don't want to have you coming from that curve and then pushing and rounding out. We're not looking for that extra curve. We just want to go into a neutral position. You should feel your core muscles tightening through here, pulling in. First step, just get used to being able to contract and relax, moving through that while still maintaining your breath, being able to kind of contract, not coming too far. Once that feels comfortable, then you can start to progress into some challenging um, activities from this position. So a good one that we often use is a bird dog. You can start by first just trying to maintain this low back position while alternating arms back and forth. This is going to be the easiest version of this. If you don't feel much of a challenge with that, then you can progress to just sending one leg out. Now the big thing to watch here is making sure you're maintaining that neutral spine. We don't want this high kick and that arch returning. So make sure you're keeping your leg in a position that it's not going so high. A lot of times we'll have tight hip flexors uh, that are not allowing us to go through that range. So you're just gonna come from resting position into neutral, abs are engaged, and then sending one leg back and then the other. You also want to make sure you're not getting this big rocking motion. Utilizing your core should keep you pretty much in the same position, even while you're shooting one leg out. Now the next progression from there will be an alternating arm, alternating leg. So again, get to that nice neutral spine position, lower abdominals are engaged. You shouldn't feel a lot of strain through your upper abdominals into your chest, shoulders making forward weights up on to your shoulders and then you're just going to send one leg back and the opposite arm back hold and then return to your starting point you want to make sure that you're moving slow and controlled back and forth with this again you want to make sure that you're not creating that arch in through your low back with it because that's going to put these muscles in a more relaxed stretch out stage. So just coming, alternating side to side. As you switch back and forth, make sure that you're still engaging through your core. This is kind of the first step into getting back into being able to plank, really feel those muscles start to start kicking on. Um, if this sounds like something you need help with, give us a call here at the physio room. We'd love to help you work through, figure out what if you're engaging in the right area, give you some extra tips of how to get the right muscles engaging when you need them.